Record-breaking flooding has ravaged parts of the Midwest. It is now to blame for at least two deaths. Raging floodwaters have particularly breached a dam in Minnesota, and residents downstream might need to evacuate. It was a similar scene along the Iowa-South Dakota state border. A train bridge connecting the two states collapsed after being overtaken by the rising Big Sioux River, which reached a record high water level of roughly 45 feet and 100 miles to the northeast. The city of Spencer, Iowa, is only now starting to emerge from the receding floodwaters of the nearby Little Sioux River, which crested nearly six feet above its previous record. We have about 18 inches of rain over the last couple of weeks. Um, what's happened is we've inundated the ground. There's nowhere for it to go. Now, there are flash flood warnings for more than a dozen waterways in the Midwest, many of which flow into the Missouri and the Mississippi rivers.